the South African under-18 side about to get their under-18 international series campaign going. And they're taking on France under-18. The man with a massive left boot, Ian van der Merwe, the vice captain of the South African under-18 side, gets us going. Early opportunity goes to Diego Jurt. Strike was good. Flags are raised. Jurt with the second attempt. No problems for Diego Jurt. Winton gets it away again. Jurt, long pass. Space on the outside now. On the inside, Dutil. This is a champagne rugby by the French. Boyshaw, they deserve this. Try time for France. But just look at this. Look at the handling out wide. And then the ability to offload. And it's like we saw with England earlier against Western Provinces. Forwards and backs combining. Rates with the final pass. And just a bit of a fend from Boyshaw. Fair turnover. Was he carrying his body weight? Space on the left-hand side once again. France looking dangerous. South African defence caught at sixes and sevens. George Gerard through the middle. They passed. Martin Bonnard. Mignot. France on fire. And then it's just sensational rugby from there. France just getting the ball through the hands. And Mignot finishing it off with the simplest of conversions and uh, at half time it is France that put the South African under 18 side to the sword the South African under 18 side will need to rise in the second half they trail France by 23 points to null borrowing his way forward the big tight head from the free state penalty P takes quickly He's got to release him Ashim Pied. that's how you make an impact big big carry from Erasmus and then Hashim Pied going quickly so quickly that there's no one home for France massive hit up in midfield boy Shaw once more better defense from South Africa early on in the second half Dutil gets his hand through the tackle Ipsayen great carry by the France captain Adrien Drol Magical start! I was almost on my feet in praise of it. Ipsayen carrying like the captain he is. That offload is pretty good, but just look at this from Adrian Drop. On the march, Marzullo has to watch out not to join from the side. Penalty, Pete takes quickly once more. They can't play him. Gets it away to Janko Purchase. Purchase in the corner. Malchas. Adds the extras. What a kick. Five meters out from the South African line. Taken by Elio Dutil. They immediately get their rolling ball going. They've got uh, all the momentum. Still moving forward. It's France. Gerald. Can he get over? Yes, says the referee. To go for the corner from the penalty, to set up the mall, to take South Africa on at what is one of their great strengths, no matter what age group, and to go across the line. I'm sure they'll just check to see if there was a bit of obstruction there. Malchas, great offload to Luyanda Kunene, who gets it away. Cheswell Uester, what a tackle! But above all else, pace. How did he get there? Oh, look at that. That is absolutely fantastic. All will be forgiven. JJ Tron hanging around in the back line because it's seven versus seven at scrum time. And under 18 rules. Yellow card to France. Ashim Pied. Can he get over? Yes, says Sean Miller. If it's not a try, it's a bad decision. If it's a try, it's a good decision. But the way Hashim P has played since he came on, you really did feel he'd have an impact on the South African side. Pete, since he's come on, been fantastic. But if Sayen has just been a class above everyone else on the field today, a wondrous performance from the number eight.
Yeah, it's been absolutely fantastic. Peed. A little grabber. South Africa on the chase. Can they regather? Over in the corner. Try award it. Well, just look at this. Hashim Peed just stabs it through. The bounce of a rugby ball. It's so, so difficult to tidy up. And surely it's Sean done. Muller will bring uh, time to proceedings. France raises the arms in victory. What a memorable day it will be for the visitors. It really has been an absolutely fantastic performance from France. France under 18, 37. South Africa under 18, 24.